another communicative strategy deployed by Hindutva is silencing. Let's consider, for instance, conversations on poverty and inequality in India. Hindutva frames these conversations on poverty and inequality as anti-national, as against the interests of India, and as part of some colonial agenda. This framing actually works to silence any conversation on the economic uh, metrics under the current um, BJP regime in India. It erases any conversation on the actual economic struggles of people, on the rising inequality that we see in India, and the tremendous consolidation of power in the hands of few corporate business interests. So this work of silencing then works alongside the projection of communal narratives, the continual vilification of Muslims, the othering of Muslims, that then holds up the Hindutva infrastructure. To the extent that we continue to have these conversations on poverty, on the struggles of the poor and the working classes in India, on the growing inequality that we witness in India, we continue to disrupt these uh, strategies of propaganda that are deployed by Hindutva and that we continue to turn to the actual issues, particularly the economic issues that uh, plague India in the contemporary context. Thank you.